Hi, welcome to my channel, The Magic of Math. This is my new series on Did You Know? The first video in the Did You Know? series is The Many Invisible Ones in Math. So did you know the number four has two invisible ones? This is true for all whole numbers. So I just picked four as an example. The first invisible one is that it has a denominator of one. So any whole number, any number can be written with a denominator of one. So four is really four over one. Did you know that the number four also has an invisible one exponent? So any number that doesn't have an exponent really does have an exponent. It's an exponent of one. That means take four once. That's one four. With an exponent of two would be two fours, four times four, knowing that exponents is repeated multiplication. But know that there is an exponent there. It's just one. Did you know that any variable has three invisible ones. So here's x, and I'm going to show you the three invisible ones. So the first is that you could write it as a denominator of one. So whatever x is equal to, the value of x that somebody would give you or you would know, could be written over one. x can also be written with an exponent of one. That's x to the first. So that's a power, x to the exponent one. It's just invisible and we don't write it because it's redundant, we don't need it because x to the one and x are the same thing, All right? Also has a coefficient of one. So there's your three ones. X is one X. It's like saying I have a cookie, you have one cookie. So X is really one X and any other number coefficient other than one needs to be written there. But when we see just x, it means 1x. OK. The last mystery reveal is, did you know about negative x? And what does that really mean? And it can be written as negative 1x. So that 1 is still invisible. And when the negative sign is there, it means negative one multiplied by x. So remember, not only is that one invisible, or this in this case, the negative one, there's an invisible multiplication sign between a coefficient and a number. So this is really negative one multiply by the value of x, negative one times x. And that's it, that's the invisible one. Thanks for joining me today. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel.